Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. According to a recent article, suicides surpass all deaths of accidents and wars and natural disasters combined. It's happening. And you know, people don't talk about it. We had the gospel team in Las Vegas, and I was up early and I went out and I found a homeless guy and took him for breakfast. And as we're talking, he said to me, you know, I see it all the time. Other people don't see it. If you're up early in the morning, there are trucks that go around Las Vegas to pick up the suicides. It's a sad world. And anybody who thinks is driven to one of two conclusions. There's no hope. Or only God can give us hope. Those are the only two options. And Solomon's argument is, it's a bad idea to try and find purpose and satisfaction in a closed system. These guys, they get a yacht. I think I'll build a yacht. I think I'll have a 100-foot yacht. Oh, a 200-foot yacht. We can't just have one helicopter pad. We have to have three helicopter pads. You know, guys like Jeff Bezos. I think I'll build a yacht. I think I'll have a yacht inside the yacht so we can get from, you know, the yacht to the harbor. And real, aren't these smart guys? Do they start to see a trend here? That this world can't satisfy. The hymn writer said, I tried in vain a thousand ways my fears to quell, my hopes to raise. But what I need, the Bible says, is ever only Jesus. He's the only one who can satisfy. Now you see, there are people, they're, they're born at the river's mouth where it's been polluted by all of our human ideas. And they've convinced themselves that the polluted water in the river is actually latte with a foam on it. And they keep drinking this stuff. And they wonder why they're not happy. And then one day somebody shows up and says, Hey everybody, <laughs> I've been to the source. I've been to the fountainhead. It's pure and clean and refreshing. It's wonderful. Come on with me to the fountainhead. And everybody says, you're crazy, man. This is it. This is, no, you can't get better than this. He says, yeah, you can. I've drunk this stuff. And I've been to the fountainhead and I've drunk this stuff. You have no point of comparison. But I do. You'll know it is true when it happens to you. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Happy is the one who trusts in him.